There are many routes into professional cycling, but few have taken the path of Team Lotto NL Jumbo's Primoz Roglic. A former junior world champion ski jumper for Slovenia, injury saw Roglic trade the skis for the saddle, and after a meteoric rise through the ranks, the Lotto Jumbo rider found himself on top of the podium after stage nine of the Giro d'Italia. Quite a long time ago, I started with my eight years. Uh, quite young uh, with ski jumping. Then uh, uh, was quite quite good, but at the end just uh, lack of motivation, also some problems uh, with injuries with my knees, and I quickly decided to change my sport. This man, though, was the real surprise package of the day. The Slovenian rider in the colours of the Dutch team Lotto NL Jumbo, a former ski jumper himself, Primoz Roglic. He went off very early in the day, and when he crossed the line, he set a time that no one could come close to beating. I uh, sold my motorbike and yeah, buy uh, the first time for the first time uh, uh, for myself a uh, road bike. I was immediately good and yeah. I just uh, think, thought, uh, why not, uh, I should try. In both sports, uh, has have to be skinny and yeah, uh, in both sports uh, has strong legs, but just the muscles, uh, I think, are really different. Uh, in ski jumping, you need just quick one, explosive one, but here, yeah, you also need explosive at the end, obviously, but more like uh, in, for endurance. And Roglic hasn't looked back since. Now, rather than hurtling down ski jumps, he's discovered a natural ability for climbing, picking up the GC at both the Tour d'Azerbaijan and his home Slovenian tour. I just wanted to be always uh, the best. I want to do uh, always the best uh, to see how quick I can go, how good I can be, and just develop, uh, I get opportunity. Luckily, uh, to start uh, with in Slovenian team, so I was dreaming to won my home stage uh, because it's obviously it's really something different when you're racing uh, at home. Impressive results that saw Roglic win a contract at Team Lotto NL Jumbo, where he quickly showed his talent. Yeah, Primoz is the new guy in the team with a very unusual background as a, as a ski jumper. I don't think ever a ski jumper made it to professional cycling, so th that's pretty special. And yeah, I, I think he's a big talent and uh, he's making progress. He has a big engine, which is really important in uh, cycling, especially in the races he, he rides. After riding in the Tour down under Tirreno Adriatico and Volta Catalunya, Roglic's next test was the Giro. And whilst Lotto and El Yombo were optimistic speaking ahead of his Grand Tour debut, not even they could have predicted quite how successful a debut it would turn out to be. Primoz Roglic turned the tables on everybody on this particular time trial stage to take his first ever Grand Tour win, his first ever Grand Tour. When he comes good out of the Giro, he can improve his level uh, just by riding in a, a big tour. And yeah, because he doesn't have the background in cycling, I think that the margin of, of improvement is bigger than uh, any other rider. Whilst Roglic may have gone into the Giro looking only to help the team, he found himself thrust into the limelight. A remarkable effort in the opener in Appledorn saw Roglic come within one one hundredth of a second of spoiling Tom Dumoulin's day on home roads. But in the rain in the Chianti time trial on stage nine, it was the Slovenian's turn to taste success as he claimed the stage in his first Grand Tour. With Roglic's performances along with Krausweg's five days in pink, the 2016 Giro d'Italia was certainly a rosy one for Team Lotto NL Jumbo.